with a crash that claimed the life of a young Las Vegas woman. You can see right here the mangled mess that's been left behind after that fire ignited from that crash. The Fox 5 drone above the crash scene here in the West Valley. Yeah, marks on the road. You can see right there those green lines as investigators were trying to determine what played out. This is happening near Rainbow Boulevard and Spring Valley Parkway. And after a closure for the entire morning commute, a tow truck finally moved out the two cars involved this afternoon. And here is the very latest on the investigation tonight. Ruggs is booked into the Clark County Detention Center tonight. A 23-year-old woman and her dog were killed waiting for her identity to be released by the coroner. Police say 22-year-old Ruggs was driving that 2020 Corvette. It hit the rear of that Toyota RAV4. Investigators say Ruggs stayed on the scene and did show signs of impairment. He's due back in court tomorrow. Plenty of neighbors in the West Valley startled from their sleep by the sound of the impact of that crash. One witness shared the aftermath as Ruggs and his girlfriend came out of the Corvette following the crash. I was doing my laundry when I when I heard a big bang. I actually have more than one. That neighbor told us he sees tons of crashes in the area, so he didn't think much of it. But then I started hearing people yelling when I got too close to the wall that it's uh, dividing the, the street and the, the apartments. I saw people trying to, you know, try to get the person, whoever was inside, um, was unconscious because they were yelling um, to get him out, get out, get out, but that person was not responding. He says he ran back to his apartment complex to grab a fire extinguisher. I got to the wall and I, I handed the fire extinguisher to somebody in there that was already helping. And by the time I tried to climb into the wall and then jump to the other side, then a the big fireball just came out of the car and we all backed up. So there was nothing that we could have done. And then, and I saw people very frustrated. I was very frustrated because I couldn't do anything. And this is when he saw two people sitting on the ground. I'm like, I'm going to get closer to see if they need any help. He says the pair looked young, but they were conscious and upset. And I can tell that he was mad that he was conscious of what he was, whatever was going on, because he was cursing. And then um, he knew what happened. 